is medical research fraud how many times do we read an article which says new research says this or science says that and we all tend to believe it right because that is the premise and promise of modern western medicine which is evidence based and rightly so we believe it but now there is trouble in paradise there is worrying amount of fraud in medical research fraud ka matlab janti ho kisi ko thagne ko ullu banane ko angrezi ma fraud kehte hai industry insiders have the opinion that it is now time to assume that medical research is fraudulent unless proven otherwise medicine is plagued by untrustworthy clinical trials now clinical trials is a research of drugs treatment protocol or device and their effects on human health number 1 who funds these clinical trials up to 60% trials are funded by the pharma industry itself in 59% of trials at least one author received financial benefits from the sponsor amongst the pharma industry funded trials 89% end up favoring the sponsor which is not surprising right industry associations also sponsor some research which in turn are funded by the manufacturer just as an example take these two studies on canola oil and their impact on health and diabetes both of these studies praise canola oil both the studies are sponsored by canola oil associations who approves these clinical trials food and drug Ad administration in united states fda is the gold standard in this regard but unfortunately fda and the pharma industry have a revolving door many fda heads who are responsible for approval of the products later join the very same pharma industry now this revolving door is not necessarily a bad thing but it casts a question mark on the authenticity of the approvals that were given now not all studies are fraudulent obviously but since most of them are coming under question mark can we trust health care which comes out of such fraudulent studies i don't know and what are our health experts and policy makers doing are we blindly relying on studies and thought leadership that comes from the west clearly that's coming from the west seems to be plagued with a lot of fraud and a lot of conflict of interest